Okay, so now we're at uh, the next step. We've done the hour of code. So let's just uh, let's take a look at what it should look like right now. Okay, so I'm going to log in and you should have 100% done. In other words, you should have completed the hour of code, which is also part of the basics course one or basic one course. But if you go back and look at your hour of code, if you don't have 100%, go back to the things, if they're not lit up, uh, if they're not checked off right here, that means that you didn't do them. And it might be something as simple as like not watching the movie, or you might have skipped something, or you might have had a problem with something. If you have a problem with something, you can go ahead and contact me and we can try to work through it. But um, do me a favor, if you're not completed until all of these are sort of checked off, <clears throat> and that means watching the introduction, watching any of the films that they have, and so forth. Another thing I'd like to point out is that, and I didn't really notice this at the beginning either, was um, the fact that there are, uh, there are instructions, like for example here, you know, the stuff that's going on here, you might be like, ah, this doesn't make any sense. But if you go down here, this is where it shows you what to do. So for example, in this one, I didn't know at the beginning that I was supposed to actually start right here. I just, I just thought, okay, just make the robot go three times around the building. So do yourself a favor, and if you're stuck on something, just scroll down and you'll see the instructions. And also right here, there's a help section so that, you know, you, if you go to the overview, it tells you, you know, basically what this thing's about. And then it can help you with things like loops and it explains stuff. So this should be of, of some help as well. Okay, so once you're once you're all set up with that, we're going to go back to uh, uh, if you just go up here to the top and go to courses. Hour of code is actually part of the basics one course, so you're going to go to just click on start, and uh, the next thing that you're going to be working on is right here painting floors. Okay, that's what we're going to be doing this week. Next week it'll be factories, and so you know you can just work through this. You don't have to do it all at once. I suggest what I suggest is you you work through the first four and you know take a break and then you can do the, the second four and that's this is the this is for the week now again as you go through this and i'm just going to pop through this so i'm not going to get the credit for it but you know go through it one at a time go through the introduction you know it it it, it takes you through it explains things read these things because what it's trying to do is it's trying to help you and if you don't pay attention to these things it's not going to make sense later on so it shows you what it's, you know, what you're supposed to do. It gives you some ideas again. What will the robot do? Look at the script, predict what the robot will do. In this case, you don't have to do anything. You just press play and then you see if you're right. Okay. And so then you go to the next one. And I guess, I guess it's not letting me move on. Yeah, I, guess I, have to, I have to press the button and watch what the robot does. Now there's something else you should notice. This, if you want to speed things up, if you click on this thing right here, uh, this makes it so fast that it's ridiculous. Here, I'll take a look. So you can't even see it. But if you just keep clicking on it, this is slow, medium, fast. So I like putting it on medium because I don't have to watch the robot slowly do its thing. Okay. So as you as you go through uh, and do these things, just pay attention to what it says here. And, um, you know, in this case, it wants you to draw a small flight of stairs and that requires that you, uh, that you paint. So it says start painting. So you're gonna write here, paint white, or which is what it wants you to do and, uh, and so forth. And just, you know, it, it's a step-by-step -step thing and doesn't look like it's gonna let me move forward. But just like I said, pay attention to the instructions down here as you move move through this, if you have any problems, you can contact me through Mr. J's help desk or uh, comments and assistance, and I will do my best to get a hold of you um, because I can actually see where you are and what you've done, and, and uh, you know I can I can get to the program. So good luck with this next one, and I'll talk to you about it on next next time.